Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It has been a while since I uploaded a makeup uh, video and it's because I am just concentrating on my well-being right now. Um, I just finished my chemotherapy probably about two weeks ago, I would say, and I feel a lot better and I don't feel sick. Um, in the next few weeks, I will be going through radiation and it's going to be about 28 days um, and I'm really hoping that it's not going to affect me the way the chemo affected me. Um, but then I'm, you know, keeping my spirit it's high um, and um, staying positive uh, throughout all this you know experience but anyways I just want to go ahead and hang out with you guys and share another makeup tutorial without further ado let's go ahead and dive in I am going to moisturize my face first and for me right now it's Olay because it fits perfectly with my skin so it really depends on what type of uh, skin you have and then I'm going to get my revolution fix and spray so it's the sports fix just because I'm gonna be sweating tonight um, normally I use in a daily basis if I'm wearing makeup or a little you know makeup I usually use this stay matte Rimmel and it's fix and go two-in-one primer and setting spray so this one this time I'm going to use this one awesome I, I am going to use my born this way Too Faced, and it's in sand uh, color and I'm going to use of course my beauty blender apparently my daughter cut it I don't know if you can see <laughs> I'm like, what is that? She was uh, playing with the scissors and she cut it. So I'm just gonna go ahead and squirt it over here like maybe a few times. One, two, three. Um, and then if we need more, then we can go ahead and just add more and then dip your sponge. So now that we are done with our foundation, I'm going to jump into my Too Faced Born This Way concealer. And this is in warm beige. Uh, works for me. A little bit lighter than your skin, I would say. All right, so now that you are done with your concealer, I'm just gonna go ahead and just set it. Alright, so now that we have set it, I'm going to go ahead and grab my uh, Tarte Shape uh, Concealer and I'm going to use it for my eyelids over here. And this is to prepare it for our eyeshadow. All right, so I am going to go ahead and grab my BH Cosmetics, um, the Ultimate Matte 42 um, Color Shadow Palette. And, okay, and this is how it looks like. It's beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and grab this color over here, kind of like a peachy color. Um, and I'm going to use my Morphe M330, and this is how it looks like. It's kind of like a transition color. And we're doing just very simple. And then you're just gonna put it over here by your crease. And then we're gonna go ahead and jump into this color over here. It's kind of like a reddish orange. And we're using this brush over here, and it is the Morphe M507. All right, and then what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and just follow the crease as well. Perfect. Kind of like a blood orange. I like that. You see that color? It made it look like orange, red orange. So we're just going to go ahead and just do that over here. All right, so after putting that color, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a very clean brush. And this is what I have, it's a little fluffy. And then just the top of it, we're just gonna kinda diffuse it. 
so it's not too harsh. Okay, and what we're going to do is we're gonna go ahead and cut the crease from here. And I am going to use my heart shape again. I got the little tiny baby one. <laughs> and I'm going to use just a flat brush over here. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my Morphe M330 again, and this is how it looks like. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab this color over here. And we're just gonna put it at the very end. So we're just gonna do that. There you go. All right, and then what we're going to do is we're gonna put this color over here on that kind of like a transition. And I'm going to use this brush over here. It's a fluffy, but kind of flat brush. And this is my Take Me Back to Brazil, BH Cosmetics as well. So we're just gonna go ahead and just grab a little bit and then tap it. And then we're just gonna kind of put that over there like that. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead, and of course it's another BH Cosmetics, it's a solar flare. And I'm gonna go ahead and just touch base with um, this color over here on the bottom, and we're just gonna put it in the inner corner. And I'm using just a flat brush right here. It's a tiny flat brush, tiny flat brush, and that's how it's gonna look like. And then we're just gonna put it in the inner corner like that. Okay, so I think I'm done right now. We're moving on to the lower lash line and this is just gonna be quick. And I'm gonna use this flat brush over here and this is my M326 by Morphe brush. And I'm just gonna touch base with this color over here. And we're gonna put it underneath. Because I don't have lashes on the bottom, I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a brown, a dark brown um, eyeliner. I'm just gonna put it on my waterline. And hope for the best. And then I'm gonna go ahead and move into my Wet n Wild H2O proof, waterproof. It's pretty good. I mean, it's not expensive, it's a drugstore brand, and it works perfectly for me. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply that, and we're gonna do a cat eye. Because I don't have eyeliner, and it will take me forever to actually perfect it. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and do it off camera, and I will be back. All right, so I'm done with my eyebrows. I'm gonna go ahead and contour this time and I'm going to use my Smashbox Holidays Contour Spotlight Palette. That's how it looks like. And I'm going to use this part over here, which is almost finished. And I'm just gonna use a flat brush like that. You can see right away that it's just doing its job. And then we're gonna go ahead and just grab the um, the True Complexion Contour Palette, and I got it from Walgreens, so. And I'm just gonna use, I normally will mix it together, but I'm going to use this one in the middle. Um, I haven't stacked any of my stuff yet because I seldom put makeup because of the uh, the treatment and um, me being tired all the time. So I'm just giving myself a lot of time to heal. So I again, I really appreciate you guys um, hanging out with me. Okay, so I am done with the contouring and I'm going to go to my BH Cosmetics uh, Summer in Saint Tropez. And we're just gonna touch base with the marina, this color over here. And we're applying it on our inner corner. See that? I like this because it's 
super blinding like that. There you go. And then of course, I'm just gonna apply it a little bit over here. And a little bit over here. A little bit over here. And a little bit here. That's not a little bit. <laughs> hmm. That's not a little bit. There you go. Um, then and then I'm just going to go ahead and grab my lip liner over here. It's an LA Girl lip liner. And I don't have a color, but it's GP512. So this is a color. Going to my Wet and Wild breeze brice okay so wet and wild breeze okay so i'm all done right now i'm gonna try to put my lashes on and my accessories and i will be back So what do you guys think of this look for today? If you do like this look, please do hit that like button and share it with your friends. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you'll be notified when new videos come in. Until my next video, I really, really appreciate your time. I will see you again soon. Bye. Bye.